Hey everyone, Ken Surfs here, and it's time for another Shea video. It's Sunday evening, I hope your weekend went good, although it's probably Monday morning now if you're watching this, because uh, I don't think I'm going to get this edited in time. But uh, today we have another Shea video, and this is with a new razor from Global Shave Club, and it's the Diablo. And it's listed as the competition for the Mercure 34C or the EJ89. Now I do have a uh, 34C here, and the difference right off the bat, of course, is uh, the 34 is a two-piece, and the Diablo is a three-piece, but the head looks very similar. So we're gonna try this out today. I found out that I have a delivery coming from Germany tomorrow, so it's the prop I need for the, uh, not that I need, that I wanted, for the GoldenEye video, so that will be coming up. Been a hard day working on the yard. Uh, got to use my first chainsaw. I know this guy should have used a chainsaw sometime in his life, but we had a tree, hated to cut it down, but uh, uh, we had to cut it down. So I ended up getting an electric chainsaw, Harbor Freight, and I've been chainsawing all day. So if I look a little sweaty, that's it. All right, and I'm gonna, I feel like Bay Rum today. So I'm gonna use uh, from two different uh, vendors from, uh, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements, Atomic Age Bay Rum Soap, and I have used this before. You've probably seen the video, but very, very, very strong Bay Rum scent. And from Captain's Choice, their Bay Rum. Very, very strong Bay Rum scent, as I would hope. And in the razor today, I will use eh, one of the blades I'm familiar with. Wilkinson Sword Gillette from India. Oh, a lot of work. It's like 85% humidity out there. Don't know how you people in Florida handle it or uh, down south, man, because in the Gulf, but that 84 humidity is just crazy. All right, the head, typical. Typical. And I understand that they are in full production of the Fat Boy now, so it's going to be coming from a Global Shave Club. All right. Oh, and the brush today. Ah, oh, man, I just grabbed the first one. I'll use the Ken Surf's Limited Edition uh, Synthetic. What's funny is there's two of these, right? Uh, the Limited Edition Badger and the Synthetic. And this, the Badger is outselling the Synthetic. It's funny because the other Ken Surf's brushes, the synthetics outsold the Badger, but for some reason the Badger here is outselling the synthetic. So uh, we will put the synthetic in here. We will get the razor ready. Oh man, we will wet the face. And let's get the shave started have a funny story to tell. Can you see, uh, well, maybe you can't, but I have a three position light switch right down here. I hate to move, well, I'll tell you why, I'm not gonna move the camera, but I have a three position light switch here, or three switches. One's the light, one's the fan, one's the heater for this, uh, this bathroom or this shaved in. And that switch broke. So my son says, hey, I can't turn the switch off, but he was able to turn it off. So my wife would left, with her girlfriend, went out, uh, went over to a bridal shower, one of those drive-by bridal showers where you drive by, and uh, had the house to myself with my daughter, my son had left, so my wife will never watch horror movies. So me and my daughter watched La La Ronia. Hope I'm saying it correctly. And it was pretty good. Can I ask you a question, Father? Do you know anything about La Llorona? The Weeping Woman. It's a folktale. To some. You know, it's just like the Annabelle, the haunted doll, you know, similar. And uh, my son tells me about this, and I go, yeah, big deal. So late at night, the uh, wife came home. Everybody's asleep. I'm on my iPad. Uh, the light goes on in this bathroom. And I'm in bed looking and I go, what the hell? I come in here, I forgot that something wrong with a switch. So I managed to get it shut off. 
the light comes on one more time, and then the mount that holds this camera to the uh, that I glued to the mirror uh, came loose and it fell into the sink. Oh man, I shouldn't watch horror movies. I thought they were. <laughs> I thought the worst. But uh, that's why I don't want to, I just re-glued this. So I don't want the uh, the glue to come loose until it's kind of cured overnight. But I wanted to get a video out because I need a shave bad. And I don't know how you guys with beards handle it. But it was so sweaty and hot today that this itched like crazy. So, Diablo. So far, feels nearly identical to the Mercura 34C. And I guess this thing comes in at 20 bucks. I know you can get the 34C yeah, around 35, maybe to 40. I don't know about the EJ89. Just taking it down. And I like the bay rum scent. Oh, crap. Yep. You see what I did? I slid it. Ah, damn it. Don't slide the razor. It's going to look like I got punched in the face now. I slid it. Oh, what an idiot. She where got me? <laughs> well, that's a blooper I'll keep in. What not to do with the DE razor, boys. I'll blame it on the heat and the uh, humidity. Wow, who would know that DE blades will cut you if you slice across them? Who would know? Not too bad, but kind of annoying. It's gonna love it when I put on that, uh, <laughs> when I put on the uh, aftershave. Worst cut I've had in a year. Last one I sliced my chin. I remember hearing from uh, Mantic 59 and he said the good folks at Cremo. See how much I like you guys? I'm continuing the shave. The good guys at Cremo had him come out and uh, shave with one of their razors. And he cut himself. I think he said they had to glue it or they had to stop for a while, stop the bleeding and then continue the shave. did. I think I did the same passes twice. Well, I'm distracted. But the razor works good. <laughs> Mailman's here. I better not use a white towel, huh? Lucky I've got the dry dock. 
Let's see if this stops it. Might have to go to the septic pin. User error. Ridiculous. Ridiculous, Ken. What an idiot. That's got to be a good deep cut, too. God, that's going to screw me up for two or three days. Slowing down. Yeah, I can actually feel the uh, how I'm working. All right, let's try it. Open it up again. You can kind of see the slice on toilet paper. <laughs> Don't speak and shave. Or you'll end up like an idiot like me. Damn, the razor works. And you can't go wrong with the bay rum. But, uh, <laughs> lesson. Not. There we go. There we go. Slowing down. Best cut I've had in a while. All right. But again, there's your competition for the Mercure 34C and the EJ89. Man, if you don't see me for a few days, I'm waiting for this to heal. I'll just shave around it because I want to do that golden eye shave, guys. All right. Have a great night. We'll see you soon.